guys, it's me again, Glamour Suzette. So, welcome back again to my channel. Today's video is since this content was really, really requested maybe last three months ago, four months ago. So I'm not sure. So I'm so sorry for being late. <laughs> I'm just so busy with my um, studies online, my projects, assignments, etc, etc, etc. So now I have no class. So this is the perfect time for me to do a tutorial video, guys, in which I will teach you how I edit my videos on TikTok, guys. So want to know how I did this video? Or this? 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 All of it. It's all the same process. So I'll teach you how I did it, guys. So please stick to the video until the very end. So let's start. Um, so if you're wondering why I'm speaking English right now, because not just my Filipino followers are asking for a tutorial, but, but also in um, to my Indonesian followers as well, because they also want to know how I edit my videos. So um, I would love to speak English so that they will be able to understand also um, the both of you. So yeah, that's it guys. So if you want to learn more how I did my videos on TikTok, then stay tuned until the end of this video because I'm so sure and very sure that you will understand and you will be able to um, do videos like mine. <laughs> so, so before we start, make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit the notification bell for more videos because I've been um, thinking of creating more tutorials. So let's start. Okay, so the first step you need to do is, of course, you need first to download the video that you want to create, the, the video you want to make with. Okay, so for example, like you want um, to do Blackpink Lovesick Girls, so you need to search on YouTube like Blackpink Lovesick Girls 4K. I would recommend you to search for the 4K fan cams because the quality is, and then also the on um, the camera is only focused on the dance. So, like. They're not changing the angles of the camera, it's only focus, guys, so um, for you to make um, easy in editing. Okay, so after you download the video, I mean, you need to download the highest quality, guys. So, I mean, the 1080p, I guess, or it depends on the um, data that you have. If you have internet, then much better if you download the highest quality of the video. So for step two is of course you need to practice the choreography. You need to practice, I and mean, you need to of course um like you need to um observe first where um part of the position would you put yourself, and also you need to um adjust the choreography if ever like um like how to explain this um. <laughs> You need to um, you need to adjust yourself. So, like also in the choreography, you need to fit yourself so that you will be able to block the other members. And also, yeah, that's it. You need to practice the video, the choreography, the dance first, so that you will be able to uh, memorize when you are about to film. Be familiarized of where you should put yourself in the video, like the position. You must be able to um, like. Um, between spaces of two members or I don't know it's up to you it's about your creativity so so that you will be able to block the other members so yeah that's for step two guys practice the choreography okay so step three for the step three is this is where we must film now our video so if we um if we download the video and then we are already memorized the choreography, the dance. Then we are now into step three, which is the filming the video. So, of course, when you're filming, make sure that you have a green screen, guys. Take it from your floor, guys, because you will be able to switch your place from different positions of the dance. So you need to, of course, um, put green screen also in the floor, not just in your background, but also in the floor. So, once you have the green screen, then you can start, um, like, Filming, filming, filming. Be able to film the dance, 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 dance. You need, you don't need to move yourself in the um in your dance area, guys, because you will be able to adjust it by yourself. So again, in step three, the filming, guys. Don't forget about the green screen. Okay. So 
the step for the last step and also which is the most difficult part is the editing now we are now into the editing part of the video which is it's very difficult guys so i want you to listen and also um yeah i want you to listen guys so that we'll be able to understand the every details that i will be explaining to this video okay so in editing we must use the application called Kinemaster. So you can find it on Play Store, guys. Search it. Just search Kinemaster on Play Store. I'm just using phone, only phone and editing and everything. Um, what I'm creating on TikTok is only for the use of the phone. I don't, I don't use like computers, etc. Digital cameras. I only use phone, guys. So. Yeah, it's very easy to use. So, again, the application that I'm using for editing is the KineMaster, guys. So, I won't, um, I recommend you to download it um, after or maybe before you um, finish the step 1, 2, and 3. So, it's up to you. But, again, in editing, you need first to have the KineMaster app. Okay, so now let's go to the application. Okay, now, so we are now going into the application. So, after you download the KineMaster app, then, okay, let's go to the KineMaster application. Okay, so this is the KineMaster application that I'm gonna use. Okay, so let's start for the editing. So, we need first to click this plus sign and then, of course, we need to um, choose this ratio, which is the 16 by 9. So that's it. the landscape type of video. Okay, so first you need to click is the video that you downloaded, the one um the choreography that you downloaded. So where is it? And, okay, so my example for this video is the secret story of Swan by I One. So I'm gonna click this video. Where is it? I can find it. Oh here it is. So okay, so as you see it's already there. So this is only a focus version of Secret Story so that I will be easy to um, um, change the position. And so with, without interrupting the interrupting like I'm um, changing angles of the camera because it might be even more difficult guys. So I'm glad that they create video to click this layer and then the media. Now, what you're gonna insert to this um, next clip is the video that you film, so yourself with the green screen. So I would click that thing. Okay, where is it? Oh my God, I can't find it, guys. Oh, here it is. So this is the green screen that I filmed. Okay, so let me show you first. <laughs> oh my God, I love my outfit, guys. <laughs> I just made them by myself, so I just, like, you know, look myself look like a princess. I made myself look like a princess so that I could be able to, um, I would be fit to the girls, of course, because they will, they are wearing Disney princess, so I need to uh, make myself, of course. Okay, so you need to crop, like, there's, uh, I'm like other colors from the, I know, from the side, so... Okay, you need to crop it guys so make sure that all of your backgrounds are green so so um after you put your video on the original video of eyes one or it's up to you what kind of video you're gonna make so you need also to adjust first yourself to the dance to the music so that you're able to fit the choreography perfectly okay so now Since now it's perfectly fit now guys, so we would now erase the background. Okay, so you need to first go into the, click the video, the green part, green screen of yourself, and then go to the chroma key. Then you need to click enable and then the key color which is the green since it is your background. Okay, now that will be the result. So, and then you need to adjust, adjust until the green will be disappear. And only you, only just you will be left. Okay, so okay, so that's for example. I'm gonna put myself next to Woon Young <laughs> since I can put myself to the very back part, uh, very back part of the um, um, 
choreography, so I'm gonna just insert myself here. So I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna block. I don't know who is this girl, but it's just only for four seconds. I don't know. So okay, after you um erase. Oh my god, it's about to rain, guys. I'm so sorry. Okay, so. So once you adjust and then you already change, I mean you already um, removed the background, then we are now into this, I don't know what it's called. Okay, so you need also to click the video and then there's a key button here in the right side, a uh, left side I mean. And then you need to click that and also key here. So what we're gonna do is every um every second you need to um like um put plus so that we're able to um oh my god it's so difficult to explain when you're speaking English guys oh my god I'm so sorry <laughs> again so you need to laban <sighs> Glen okay you need to put plus in every second of your video guys. For example, like that. Okay, so we need to adjust the video. I mean, forward to the video. Okay, next, another forward. Okay, that. That is the thing we're gonna do. Um, move forward. So again, move forward to the video, and then add plus, and then move forward. Okay, so that part. So since they already moves, I need to move myself, of course. So you need to like adjust. A little bit you know to the left side and then plus again and adjust a little side okay and then okay another side since I'm blocking Hunyung so I need to adjust myself that okay so again forward and then plus and then adjust and then plus again and then okay this part okay Okay, so I need to adjust myself again so that I won't be able to block one yung. Okay, so again, plus, plus. So I need to um, make myself little again since the video is like zooming back. So again, plus, again, plus, another plus, oh, this. Um, change the change of choreography so you need to put my I need to put myself uh, maybe in this line okay I'm gonna go with Minju is it Minju right? Minju yeah okay so need to find a position again oh here I'm gonna go here here Here, so and then again plus. Oh my God, I'm blocking Che Cheyong. I mean Cheyong. I mean that's her ch sister Cheyong. <laughs> so this is Cheyong Mulan. Okay, so I need to adjust myself again because I'm blocking Minyu. Okay, so every second there's always um like a point sign. Because this point symbolizes, it will show you where you, um, like, where you change your position, where you're gonna be in the choreography. Okay, so, that's it. And then I need to adjust myself since I'm blocking Minju again. Okay, so it's very difficult, guys. Like, for me, this is the, um, the most difficult part of making a video, but also fun at the same time. I'm enjoying making videos. I enjoy editing, guys, so... It's my hobby, so yeah. Okay, so another um, plus. Okay, I'll see. I'm dancing and I'm not blocking the other members. Okay. So of course you need to make um, you need to find a space where you can put yourself so that the video will be like, you know, like it's natural thing. Like, 
your followers, your viewers can't know, didn't know that you were there dancing with the eyes one. So, my God. Okay, so this is it. Okay, another um, change of choreography. So I don't know where to put myself. Oh, I just put myself here. Yeah. Since there's a big space. Oh, this perfect. I am between Cheyon and Yun. I mean Won Yung. There. See. So again, every second you need to um, you need to put plus on your video, on your green screen video, so that your body, your movement will change. There. Oh my god, I'm locking them. Okay, I'm so sorry, but I have no choice. I just make myself little. Okay, that's it. That's enough. Okay, so... Okay, so again guys, it's just about putting plus in every second of your video. So it's up to you where where you really you gonna put yourself in the video. It's up to you. It's about um it's now of your creativity. Okay, let's just say for example that you've done putting plus in your entire video. So and then um you're already um like feeling good at it because it feels like Okay, now it's good to you, okay. So it's now, um, the video is doing well na siya, guys. Okay, so. <laughs> okay, so after you finish, guys, is of course, you need first to export your video. I know, since my video is only here, so I'm gonna cut this video. That, okay. So there's a hack for this video so that the KineMaster watermark will be removed. So you just go to the audio and then put music assets and this is the moment. I mean you can choose any of those musics out there. Music assets, okay. And then you can um, lower the, um, the audio of that song so that it won't interrupt your dance okay so next is click this um like bluetooth sign i don't know what is this but just click this this part then click and then click export so now it's now for the quality so i would um recommend you to again export the highest quality that you can ever have then if your storage cannot like cannot handle this um kind of i know um quality so it's up to you if you will choose the lower or the most highest but I would recommend you to the highest so that your video the quality of the video will be nicer guys okay so export and then skip okay so let's just wait guys so since we choose the most um, the highest quality so the exporting will be like it takes a lot of time guys like probably um, half an hour or maybe 10 minutes it depends on the video actually it depends on how long your video is a few moments later okay so after the exporting some uh, there will be something like will disappear on the right side of the screen so this is like the untitled um, 51 this is that um, the video that you exported so what you're gonna do is you're gonna click this uh, middle circle this and then you will click the YouTube to remove the um, the watermark of the KineMaster so it will take um, another time again guys so again remove water watermark and then let's wait <sighs> another waiting guys <laughs> a few moments later okay so after the exporting so we'll go back to KineMaster again so let's go back to KineMaster 
So that um and now this um we're gonna do the fun cam version. So again you need to um click the plus and then this nine by sixteen in the middle. The ratio in the middle. So again, so need to click media and like choose any background you want, like this black. Then adjust the lens of the video. Okay, like that. Then you need to click the layer and media again and then put the video you exported like this this one we exported before and as, as you can see there's no watermarks because it is um removed by the music asset so now we're gonna do is the fan cam version so I think this is very easy now because you're just gonna focus it on yourself so again need to click your video and then this K sign and then add plus 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 again you need to adjust yourself okay so that it will be look like a fan cam that okay so plus so make sure you're always the center of this video you make yourself the center because since it's your fan cam so again you need to um, center yourself okay Okay, and then plus again, adjust, put yourself in the middle, again, plus, middle, plus, oh, where am I? I'm missing. Oh, there. Okay, so put myself again in the middle, and then add plus sign again, and put myself again, there. Okay, so, yeah, it's been, it's now easy, guys. Like, um, the first part is, like, very difficult, but then this, I uh, know, um, this fun cam type version is it's not that hard at all just gonna uh, make yourself focus on yourself putting yourself in the video only okay so that's okay so oh, where am I am missing again there okay so again okay and then plus see looks like a fun cam guys Again. and it's up to you you can zoom it like that if you want really to like if you want to see your um like i don't know your face you know it's up to you like that you want like that big am i am missing all there Just need to keep adding plus again plus plus we're almost done see it's very easy guys the fun cam is very easy but the editing of the first part is my God, it's the, the most difficult part guys Okay, so this is the end of the video for the editing okay so that so again to remove the watermark you need to put a music assets this is the moment I mean you can pick any um, songs in the music assets it's up to you so I always use this this is the moment because the music is very like it's very low you know and it won't interrupt the dance the music in the video that I'm editing so it's done and then you need to go to the exporting part again to click this um, click this and then you need to export again just like what you did earlier okay so I hope that you understand this video guys so you just need to wait since this video is exporting so it's still exporting so once it's done there will gonna be something appear again on the right side and you just click the middle part like what you did earlier so again it's the same process and you just need to um, master you need to be master this um, app of course you need to familiarize so that you're able to um, edit this faster and easily so yes I guess our tutorial ends here guys <laughs> oh my god let me switch my camera first 
So after you export that video guys, so you're ready to upload it on your social media. You can upload it on TikTok, on your Facebook, on your YouTube. It's up to you guys. So again, thank you so much for watching guys This for this tutorial guys. So, so I think our tutorial video ends right now. So I hope that you learned something from my video for today. And thank you for staying tuned until the end of this video. I hope, I hope that um, you can create like video, my videos by yourself guys so i'm hoping that you learn something and you understand although i'm not very fluent in speaking english guys so but at least i try guys so again thank you so much for watching guys and of course if you like this video don't forget to give this video a thumbs up guys and also if you're new to my channel guys so please please subscribe now to my channel and hit the notification bell for more videos guys i've been thinking to create more tutorials until you all of you understand it perfectly guys so again thank you so much for watching guys and see you on my next vlog guys bye